Hi guys, bright sunny evening, Nanny's cooking the tea, I've got 20 minutes before the tea should be ready, so we'll see if we can get this one done. Another paper aeroplane from the complete book of paper aeroplanes by David Woodruff, that cost me £1.25 in a charity shop. You can get this book on Amazon, there's a affiliate link in my video description that you could use to find it. That would actually give me some pennies uh, in theory and practice probably not because most of the books on Amazon now are second-hand ones so they're quite a bit cheaper. There's also a couple of links to other books in the video description. Anyway, with this book the idea is you tear out the page you want to fold up and fold it up and somebody's done that for this one a fire dart so it's not there which doesn't matter because i don't tear the page out i use scrap paper and follow the fold instructions and this one looks like a fairly standard schoolboy paper dart so we'll start off with a piece of a4 printer paper and it says with the printed side face down, fold in half and then unfold. I think we can manage that. If you do need to take any measurements off there, I use this ruler which has centimetres on one side which I measure on here and then inches on the other side which I then transfer onto the A4 paper. I found that a centimetre on there transferred onto my A4 piece of paper as half an inch works out perfectly. But hopefully we won't need to do any measurements here. So, it said fold that and unfold it. So we've done that. Then fold the top corner down, fold in the following the Fold line, same on that side, the more accurately you do it the better it's going to fly because if you get it wrong and one wing's bigger than the other it'll never fly straight. Right now fold of that edge. Along that fold line. This is the sort of one you would have done at school if you did them at school. I certainly made paper aeroplanes at school. I actually started a model aeroplane club at my school with one of the teachers as the mentor, I suppose you call it. Didn't last for very long, but we did do it, and our first few sessions were making paper aeroplanes before we moved on to other things. Right, done that. Now fold it in half. That does look very familiar, doesn't it? Just like an ordinary paper plane and then final fold up there oh I'm following that I'm not following that final fold here the only question is yeah I'll just guess it because we haven't got the dimensions if the page wasn't missing I'd have measured how much fuselage we wanted and how much wing how much there I'm just guessing it for now. So there we are, your fairly standard paper dart or fire darts, it calls it there. They do show the edges bent up a little bit. I'll just do that as required to trim it. But 
there we are so fire dart now that is page 182 out of 190 pages 182 out of 190 but it actually starts on page 10 and each pe each design is two pages so 180 divided by 2 is 90 so there was 90 designs although some of them were kites and I haven't done those but we're pretty close to the end we got uh, four more to do fire dart Let's see if it flies. Well, that sunlight's a bit bright, late evening, never mind, the, uh, let's get that so it's, where are we, there, okay, the fire dart, page 182 out of 190, not many left to do, oh, we've got a bent end, there we go. Yeah, classic schoolboy paper dart, and it flies fine, nice and straight, full length of the kitchen, no trouble at all. <laughs> Just trying to get that nose fairly straight. Obviously, I've been flying it, that's why the nose is a bit bent. But yeah, classic, simple, it works. No problems with that. So, end, street, end, screen, end screen time. Up here will be a video YouTube thinks you'll like on my channel. Down here is my channel. So you can have a look, see what else I do. I do far more than just paper aeroplanes. Up here will be the latest video on my channel, and down here will be a suitable playlist. In this case, Paper Planes playlist. And down below, there will always be more information in the video description. Thank you for watching, and those should be appearing about now. See you in the next video.